Uh, we got another question now from Roger. Where's Roger? Yeah. Hi, Roger. Hello. Um, are straight white male actors now dinosaurs? Yeah, it's a bit harsh, this. So this is um, the former Doctor Who actor, Christopher Eccleston. You know, he's, he's just made this comment that white straight men are, and this is his words, not mine, are quite rightly seeing acting opportunities shrink yeah. as they're now dinosaurs and the new pariahs of the entertainment industry. He's also added this odd point about how the conviction of Harvey Weinstein for cases of sexual assault reveals why it's right that white men are getting fewer acting roles. I don't understand that <laughs> point. Well, yeah. Is he saying that because Harvey Weinstein is white, and male, yeah. All, all, all white men are guilty, basically, That's, of his crimes. Yeah. I mean, that can't be true, can it? Well, um, no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> is, that, is, that, is that just an obvious question? I mean, Lewis, you, what do you feel about this? It you, is. You are, you are a straight it's white lost, male. It's lost. And first of all, we, don't make. Don't a say that. No, no, don't make assumptions. <laughs> <laughs> don't make. Is it? Is it? First of all, Harvey Weinstein is not around, so that I can can't get those jobs that are now available. No, no. Because he's not... He was never an actor anyway. I don't understand he, this. No, but he was... The idea was you could go... You could... If you made him happy... You know how older guy, gay guys get? They get. A, they can get he's a bit... He's not gay! Most certainly yeah. not no, no, gay. No. I think, I think the really... I, I would you... just like to say, I went for a job the other day, an acting job. I didn't get it. It wasn't because Harvey Weinstein and his <laughs> despicable crimes. It was because I was properly rubbish. So <laughs> yeah. I think we're very clear about or that. Or maybe you weren't right for the role. It was a biopic of Oprah Winfrey. <laughs> <laughs> and that wasn't right. No, but, I mean, you, you're in a lot of films. And you, yes. And, no, I'm not joking. He, he was in... What were you in Wonder Woman? The two? Duke. <laughs> the Duke. I don't think you were in the Duke. I don't though. remember all of them. I, no. I, I, Indiana Jones. Yeah. I was with. Uh, I was in. I'm in Indiana Jones. So, but, but, but you played the rock. The new right? one. You, the, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in. I'm in uh, the other one um, with um, the Fantastic Beasts. I don't, no you don't even know which films you're in. You don't know. Anybody in the film business, it's always a QT. You keep the film quiet. No one wants... To, I'm not, yeah. But do you think that, that white, white men, straight white men, deserve not to get roles anymore because of the behaviour of a few of them? Nothing personal, but no one is interested in 58-year-old people. Let alone so it's an that. age thing. It is an age thing. As a person who is that age, I can say that because I'm that age. No one's interested. He's not. In he's age. 62. Uh, <laughs> is it, I mean, is there an ageism issue here, John? Yes, absolutely. That's one of the things that we're going to talk about. As when you know, we talk about privilege and stuff. They are the, and as someone who does comedy about this, but yeah. I do believe it's a thing. Uh, uh, being good looking is a privilege. There are, there are many different yeah. privileges. I think we're going to talk about accents later on as well. Yeah, yeah. There are lots of different facets, but are advantages. I always felt, and even the person who came up with. Right Privilege, uh, she says it was the wrong word. You yeah. could just call it advantages.